Hey guys, today we're back on the Xbox as a homeowner. It's yet another beautiful Sunday morning here in Griffin, Indiana. It's going to be really hot out, almost 95 degrees. And we do have quite a few projects. So hopefully we can get them done early and then enjoy the rest of the day. Let's come on over here and give Charlie a bowl of food. You guys can see the grass is pretty tall. We've gotten quite a lot of rain, especially for being the summer months when we do have several uh, droughts here. But Charlie is a really good dog here. He's always running around and he does like going in the pool when everyone else does here. Let's give him another, another bowl of food and let's head around to the garage. Like always, guys, there's a full mods list link down below. And if you do end up enjoying today's video, please hit the like button as it does help out with the algorithms here. But look at this all new electric toy I recently picked up here $500 for it this thing is pretty fancy it goes almost 20 miles per hour for a scooter I mean I, I think that's a little unsafe they're going too fast but this thing is so much fun to rip around why don't we hop on it and uh, we can probably go to the street and uh, kind of ride around hopefully there's not too many cars around I've been really enjoying the homeowner series so far here. There's so many projects, so many things we're working on, and I've been really liking it now. Guys, I have been switching between both the Xboxes here. Looks like some of the mods uh, do end up getting a release a little bit later on for the Series X, and you guys can just see it in the title which one we're on here, but the Xbox One still uh, is pretty awesome. I can't wait uh, for new, the uh, new farm sim. I'm going to be doing both PC and console videos, which should be pretty exciting. Oh man, the scooter's quite a bit of fun here, but we actually got to get that plugged in here. It's running low on battery, but here we have, guys, our Barn Fine F100. We found this last week. I actually did a full oil change, full brake flush, and I've actually been driving it around town to do some small errands, and I will say, guys, I'm so excited to have this, and uh, we are actually going to be doing a few things here, too. So one thing, guys, I think it's sitting a little bit too low, and I want kind of more off-road uh, tires on it, as well as, I think, a little bit less chrome would not be too bad here so we're gonna put this up on the lift but before we do this I actually want to do a different uh, uh, project on a truck Here's our NMC Reaper, our crew cab pickup truck, pretty much my daily driver. But guys, I want to put a new front bumper on it. I finally, finally got the last parts here for it. I was actually going to show you guys last week, but sometimes uh, just getting the parts in uh, has been quite a bit uh, challenging here lately. But I think let's bring this around there to the toolbox and let's uh, get the new bumper put on. I got the new bumper installed here. Took about an hour and a half, but look at that, guys. I will say that it looks so cool here. Really do like the color match pieces along with... Uh, you do have two huge tow hooks here as well, but look at that guys really uh, just with a simple bumper upgrade can make the truck look quite a bit better now one thing guys I've been looking at uh, I might end up wrapping the uh, fenders the same color as the truck here I've been looking into it and I'm not exactly sure if I'm gonna like it So I think wrapping it uh, would be the way to go and hey if we like it We could always paint it here, but I'm gonna look for a new uh, back bumper Maybe a bed cover maybe a toolbox, but overall this has been a pretty good truck here But I actually have a friend on the way to help us on out uh, because like I mentioned guys we are going to be putting new wheels and tires on this but we are going to be putting a two inch lift kit on it and actually it's really a two inch block that we're putting in the suspension I want to keep this truck as stock as possible as original as possible and I really want to lift the truck just a little bit without uh, changing the suspension so let's bring it back around to lift There it goes up on the lift here. My friend should be here any minute and I'm just getting it ready here for us. But I will say guys, everybody needs a truck lift here. They are pretty affordable in my opinion and they do come in pretty handy. Although I would really like it inside the barn, but with the ceiling that just wouldn't happen here. Maybe we could build a little carport, but look at the underneath here guys for a 1975 uh, pickup truck. Uh, this thing is in really good condition. No rust here on it. So I think I'm going to have to put this in the uh, garage all winter long we want to keep it looking like this here but I'll catch you guys back when we uh, do the a little a bit of a lift kit and the new wheels and tires 
Well guys, it took a little bit longer than I expected, but look at that guys, we have a 2 inch lift kit on the new wheels and tires. Now I think the tires alone, it, uh, since we're going a lot beefier tires, off-road tires, it's really going to help us on out. And I think in total probably 4 inches, oh yeah boys, that looks quite a bit better. I really do kind of uh, like the blacked out wheels as well, although I do like the uh, chrome on it, I think the black really, uh, really sets it off quite a bit here. Let's get it backed out here in the sun and take a whole new look at it, oh yeah, that looks looks pretty sweet here now I don't think uh, the suspension will be any rougher here now we are kind of stretching out uh, the suspension uh, flex a little bit here which uh, it might cause a little bit of a rough ride but so far I don't really think it is and hey we're really only driving around town here with this but boys this thing looks so here uh, cool here just look at that I think I made the right call here. This thing looks unbelievable here. Really do like the dark blue black wheels. And look at those off-road tires here on. Each tire was around 150, which isn't too bad here as well. But I would say for new tires and uh, $100 worth of uh, uh, suspension blocks, this came out quite well here. You guys can actually see it has a very nice bed liner. I do just want to probably do a polish on it. See if we could do a little bit of a polish to chrome uh, to make it stand out even better. But I will say, guys, this truck is going to be around for a very a very long time i want to keep it and the owner actually said he was going to come by i think this weekend as well and uh, check it out here but guys there is something we need to go uh pick up at the local store you guys know uh we our grass needs to be cut here and we only have a small john deere tractor but the problem is we cannot get up close to the building here so i've been looking and looking for a weed uh, string trimmer here and I finally found one it finally came to console uh, so I think we're gonna have to get the truck and trailer for it and let's head on over to the store our property is just over five acres here, but you guys know we have quite a few different things. We have trees, we have garage, we have a pole, a pole barn, we have patios, we have so many different things, and we really can't get too close to them with the mower deck. So this weed uh, trimmer is going to come in really handy. It was only, I believe it was $250. It was a bit pricey uh, for what I was uh, willing to pay here, but it's going to really help uh, clean it up here. I'm always mowing and always right around trees and everything. The grass is like a foot tall here, so it's going to clean it up. All the little details I am a huge uh, part of here, especially Weed Eater on the Xbox, is going to be so much fun to use. Now, I hope everyone's having an amazing day. Let me know how it is down below. My day's been pretty good here. I've been doing a few things around the house, getting it out, and enjoying the warm weather as well. Here, but let's see, let's see. I believe it's right outside. I did do an uh, online order store pickup, and oh yeah, look at that. It's ready to go for us. We got the ramps on the trailer ready to go here. Now this weed eater, this string trimmer is actually a vehicle for it to fully function. Let's get it fired on up here. Look at this guys. It is a pretty much the steel, uh, which is a pretty awesome here. But let's get the blade running. You could definitely hear it, guys. It is pretty sweet here. And let's see if we could get loaded up on the truck here. And I will say, guys, I really do wish the F-350 did have ramps uh, 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 that go off the tailgate there. That would be a definitely a pretty cool add-on. And that would really come in pretty handy sometimes. So let's get on back to the house. And let's put it to work. Now, getting new yard tools, any type of tools, is almost like a kid on Christmas. I'm always so excited uh, to put them to work, give them a try, and just get projects done with it here. And like I mentioned, the Weed Eater is really going to uh, help us on out quite a bit here. But if you do have any cool ideas here for me, please let me know. I really do enjoy making these types of videos. These are a lot of fun. And like I mentioned, guys, uh, earlier, there is a full mods list up on my website. Every single mod I use here with the series uh, can be found over there the exact model where to find it in the store so you can download it and enjoy it in your own game as well Wow, guys, we got quite a lot done here. It's only 2 p.m. here, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to do all the weed eating now and then. I'm actually going to mow the lawn here. I should be able to get done probably by 5 and enjoy the rest of the day out by the pool here. But look at that, guys. Putting the new weed eater to work is so cool. It's so awesome. We are getting more and more mods here on the Xbox uh, as well, and uh, these are just so cool here. Now, all the Xbox uh, PlayStation mods are also on the uh, PC and Mac as well, but you guys can see this is pretty Pretty sweet here, so I'm gonna keep on weed eating here and then hop on the riding mower and get the property looking even good here. Get all the tall grass mowed on down. But I hope you guys enjoyed uh, today's homeowner series video here on the Xbox. But until next time, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.